the golden barrel cactus is what we're showing today and it's also referred to as the golden ball and sometimes as mother-in-law's cushion now I want to show you my barrel cactus this barrel cactus is rather large I um, planted this probably around 10 years ago and it's actually growing on an angle because I planted it on, a, on an angle on accident and um, if you notice at the top there's the flowers very very prickly these are very very tough I don't know if you can hear that okay let's talk a little bit about this cactus it's called a Kino cactus grusoni but in Greek a kino is really not pronounced a kino. It's actually a hino. And a hino in Greek means spiny. Now this is a small golden barrel cactus and it's about nine inches in diameter by nine inches high. The first one I showed you was 19 inches in diameter by 19 inches high. And the last one I'm gonna show you is gonna be 15 inches in diameter by 11 inches high. Now these really require little to no watering. What you should do is pretty much water them maybe every two weeks during the summer. The golden barrel cactus is really native to southwestern United States and to Mexico and it loves the East Valley or Phoenix heat and sun. It grows very slowly and can thrive in sandy and poor soil types as long as you know it has full sunlight and is protected from hard frosts. These are considered rare and critically endangered in the wild and they have yellow flowers in the spring followed by small rounded or oblong yellow fruit. You can notice that each fold or ridge creates a shade to some part of the cactus as the sun moves, thus keeping it cool. It has straight, lightly colored thorns that also create a barrier of coverage providing this cactus with its golden color. What a great cactus!